Hey, greetings everybody. Larry here from the Larry's Fountain Pen Review. And we have a mail call coming up today, so let's get right to the mail call. Let's see what's in the box today. A lot of peanuts. And I'll set that aside. Open that up. And I got a couple of Monteverdi Engage. One to demonstrator. I got these in an auction. And this is going to a new home. And this will stay here with me. So, yeah, I've been looking at these fellas and I'm thinking I need to try I mean uh, a friend of mine likes the uh, and demonstrator type so bah there you go well that's cool I can dig it all right let's see what's in the package now I think this could be vintage I think I'm, I think it could be Waterman Vintage, I think. Here we go. And this is one I've really been waiting for. Now, it doesn't have a box, but it's, I'll let Mr. Announcer do the honors. Okay, this is a 1950s, uh, I'm not sure what that word is, Parker 51 Gray Fountain Pen. It's the D-E-M-1, I think. And uh, I will let you know what that stands for. It's part of the... Uh, I believe concerning the year of the pen so it would be very interesting and I did want this pen particularly let me get this little jewel off as I cut my fingers voila I'm going to keep that and we'll get it out of here. Make sure that's the receipt. Like that. And here we go. Maybe I can just get that out of here. Maybe not. It's a Parker, I'm sorry, not Waterman Parker. I do have a Waterman coming in, but this is the Parker, I'm sorry. I have Waterman on the brain. Pin, pins, and pins. She is. She is home. The Parker 51. I have a couple of Parker 51s, but this one is a totally different one. And I will check the pin out. And uh, I will go from there. So, thank you for joining me today on mail call Larry's found pin reviews be safe my friends god bless and remember don't text and drive